Season 3's brand new update is insane. Columbo is back. Darth Vader has arrived. And, well, let me just show you. Star Wars. Hey, get out of here, loser. It's mine. Season 3's first major official update is in-game, and we have Star Wars. Hello? Star Vader. It's official, boy. Star Vader is in our Fortnite game, bro. Yo, and he's crazy. Oh, my goodness. Yo, we were predicting that boss Darth Vader would finally come to our Fortnite game, and it is absolutely true. Darth Vader and his stormtroopers have officially landed to our island. It's official. Count how many times I said official. Not only this, when players log into our Fortnite game, they actually get to see the Star Wars spaceship fly down to our Fortnite island. Not only this, a secret chest spawn location has appeared literally nowhere you can find Darth Vader. It seems to drop only Star Wars related items, but if you didn't know, this is in game. There is no mistaking. We believed that Star Wars was coming to this Fortnite season, and it's true. Oh, and there's the mythic weapon, dude. We knew. Oh, hold on. <laughs> oh, okay. Super cool. I'm gonna do the wheel spins a little later on, okay? We just gotta get into this video. Well, it's officially happened. Star Wars is now in our Fortnite game, but this is not the only crazy change that is going on in Fortnite. No, sir. Check this out. In season three's brand new updates, players have reported seeing giant footprints seemingly belonging to Columbo. And they can be found somewhere in the purple biome forest location. Ooh, the question is, uh, where? I, I actually don't know. I'll be honest, I took a look around just before I started this video, but, uh, yo, is it just me or is this forest a little spooky? Uh, uh, this post was posted on Reddit showing what seems to be a giant footprint of some kind of beast. This does look incredibly similar to thumbnails that were recently produced online. So I wonder if Epic Games took the hint or everybody else knew something was coming. What is most interesting about this finding is this would mean that if Columbo's footprints are now in game, the most recent update in Fortnite, then Columbo himself must be alive and living. Hence why I said alive, you know. If he's alive, he's living. Hey, what are you, stupid? Stupid. <laughs> All we can really work out from this image is it's close to a river, and it's presumably in the purple forest biome location. There are rivers in our Fortnite game, so it doesn't narrow it down too much, but I, I actually don't know. I actually don't know if this is real. I'm gonna be honest, I haven't seen many people report on this yet, with it being just added in season three. But the mystery of this giant's footprint in our game and its exact location could be uncovered by somebody else. If you find it, let me know. Man, I really wish this guy would go home. <laughs> Bro, if you knew you couldn't win, why try to fight me? Not only this, more information in the game's files have revealed what Columbo's brand new dance animation is going to look like. Yes, this is Columbo, but this has been created by leakers behind the scenes. We know a new version of Columbo is going to be added with a secret new dance animation. The leakers have got the dance animation, applied it to Columbo. This is exactly what it's gonna look like. With all this talk of footprints of Columbo arriving to our game, we can know for sure that this is what Columbo's new dance animation is going to be. Be. The fact that this has been covered in season three may lend some credits to the fact that these giant footprints might be real. This is one situation we're gonna have to keep an eye on. Could all this mean that there is a Columbo still alive in our Fortnite season three game? A Columbo that doesn't spawn in the same place, but is in fact very hard to find. A Columbo that has been forgotten, lost in time. The last Columbo. What about the last surviving Columbo? He could be old, miserable, covered in hair. As he wanders our season three Fortnite's game. Yo, this could be the future of season three. The future of Columbo. Oh, hey, I checked out one of my old videos on Columbo. And there was like a whole video where I referred to him as Columbus. Let's go. Come with me. That's right. All the way over here, Columbus. Come on, Columbus. Hey, I just discovered it recently. I thought it was pretty cringe. Hey, I just thought I'd share it with the gang, huh? Anyway, back to the video. Ooh, speaking of locations to keep an eye on, the Logjam Lumyard. I mean, the Logjam Lotus has just been updated. Yes, it is true. Logjam has changed actually in a crazy way, but it gets even more crazier, and this is exactly why you need to keep an eye on it. The Logjam Lumyard Lotus location is changing every single game. I'm not kidding you. If you guys actually log in multiple times to this location and land at the Logjam Lotus, you're gonna find that the location looks different almost every time. And I say almost every time, there are a handful of locations that it mixes between. It does mean that every time you log in, you're gonna be logging in to a new location. <laughs> Oh, if you can't tell. I'm carefully trying to avoid numbering how many location changes there are. Not this location because I don't actually know. So you guys are gonna have to come down here and check it out all for yourself. All the different locations at Logjam Lumya. Logjam Lotus, I'm sorry, I'm sorry I keep getting it wrong. Now me, I'm starting to think it's got something to do with this bad boy right here. The Lotus Tree. Oh, with all the changes in Season 3's update, what we've actually learned is Lotus Trees are appearing across our island and every time they do, they're infesting the location with their roots and bending them into 
into different realities. With the logjam being affected by this lotus tree and switching between realities every game, we can assume every other location where one of these trees are going to appear is going to change forever. And of course, the next location to change forever seems to be Buttercake's Barn. Another route has appeared with a future lotus tree. So we can assume that Butter Barn's better change. It's better be gone. And which location is going to switch realities with it? Well, only time will tell. But I'm excited to okay. find out. We've had Darth Vader, Colombo, brand new reality realms, and now, of course, we have Tilted Towers. Oh, hold on. The towers have seen some major changes in the latest season 3 update. They're pretty big, which you may not have noticed. After the fight against the imagined order, Tilted Towers was destroyed, but it's now officially being rebuilt. Epic Games did some kind of competition where players could redesign Tilted Towers, and that would be the Tilted that would get remade. And it would seem we have a winner, and Tilted Towers is finally on the way. Yo, it is pretty rough still in Tilted, so uh, don't think everybody's gonna be friendly now it's being rebuilt, huh? With Tilted Towers being reconstructed, this may be one of the biggest updates that we've had not only in season three, but maybe the most amount of location changes that we've ever had in an update. I mean, it's like four locations that have been tweaked to this season, and with some of them changing randomly, this for sure means most location changes ever in one video. Maybe possibly. Hey, who knows? Maybe everybody is friendly now. I'm gonna take this loot if nobody wants it. Wow, two the towers has changed, man. But this place used to be. Ooh. Oh, yo, I got eliminated twice this video, bro, and each time it was cheese. That means I owe. Oh, two elimination spins. The elimination wheel. Come on. I mean, looking at the time, bro, I gotta get this video edited and up. I mean, I don't know, bro. I know I owe two, but maybe we'll just we'll, we'll just transfer oh them over God. to the next video. I'll just move them to the next one and we'll just do two straight away in the next video. What do you say? What do you guys say? No. What? No deal? Huh, I don't care. This is my show. We're moving them to the next video. Okay, fine. We'll spin the wheel now. If any of these are in game, we're doing it in the next video. Oh, yes, sir. Hey, yeah. Yes, sir! Blank, do nothing. Hey, you guys want me to spin the wheel? I'll be doing nothing. Thank you. I owe two spins. I just spun one. This is my last spin, bro. This is my last spin, bro. Spin wheel twice. Are you kidding me? Where was this one put into the wheel? Oh, I gotta spin it two more times. Oh, come on. Come on. A remove HUD. Okay, look, I'm doing that one next time. In the next video, we'll just start off the HUD removed. Okay, let's just spin one more. No crouching or sprinting. Oh my god. Can you imagine? No crouching and sprinting and with no hug. Dude, this next video is going to be a mess. Oh my goodness, dude. Put a credit code on screen right now if you want to support the channel, guys. Check out some more season three videos that we've done literally on screen right now. Oh, and if you actually find that Columbo footprint, let me know. I need to know. Guys, I'm gonna catch you all in the next crazy season three for tonight's video. Thanks a bunch, guys. Peace.